Hi Capricorn, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Capricorn with a clear, concise message from you. Okay, so Capricorn, how you're coming into the reading is um, the snake, okay? It says, uh, I don't know if you can read that, shed old skin, yeah. Shed old skin, yeah. Will it focus? Will it focus? It won't. Okay. Um, but anyhow, it says shed old skin. So this is about awareness, uh, increased awareness, heightened senses, intuition. It talks about the highest level of spirituality, whatever it is you practice. But it talks about you um, seeing things differently, letting go of something. I was getting, you know, some of you need to let go of laziness here or you need to really stop the procrastination. You need to ask yourself, are you ready to do all that you need to do to make your dreams, your goals a reality. Some of you need to plan and pre-plan and go back to the drawing board and plan again. Some of you, if you're in romantic relationships, you actually need to plan for that relationship, especially if it's taking a turn or going towards the downside or there has been ups and downs or upheaval in the relationship. Y'all, y'all need a plan. You need to go talk to a third party about where the relationship is going and how you guys can get there. It does say that a tough, uh, an end to a tough cycle is approaching Capricorn. It's like, um, you're going to get some type of help, some type of guidance. Okay. Maybe around your birthday. Cause you do have the gift card and this talks about birthday. It also talks about winter. You are a winter baby for some of you. Uh, most of you. Um, so it, it says that maybe you'll get help. You'll get assistance. You'll get some aid. You'll get something that um, pushes you forward. And then with that, you have ask others for help. Okay, if you're trying to achieve something, accomplish something, then you can do so. It's about letting go of that old paradigm of maybe procrastination, being proud. Um, you got to let it go. You have to open up and you have to um, maybe either accept help, ask for help, put yourself out there because there's someone who wants to reciprocate Um with you and they want to meet your your need fulfill your need here um some of you this is a relationship you need to let it go um it's a lot of hard work and you might even get the opportunity to let it go or meet someone new around the next holiday ask others for help in terms of how to get out of this or move away from it or let go of something or someone here some of you feel like you're not able to be yourself or show people your true self. You will have the opportunity to do so. Let's see what the Tarot has to say for Capricorn. What's the Tarot have to say to Capricorn? Three cards for it. Okay. Page of Swords. So some of you need to think. Think of new opportunities. Think of um, outside of the box opportunities to make money. Uh, this is also a very, you know, um, verbal, uh, cerebral type of relationship where you always feel like you need to be calculated in what you say to this person. Lots of games and immaturity in terms of how you express your emotions, you know, verbally. Um, either you or the other person. Um, this also could be gossip. You could be the subject of gossip, maybe even slander. Let's see what's going on here. Um, there could be delays or delaying news here. Um, you don't, you don't necessarily get a no answer, but it could be, um, that it is delayed. Let's see. Yeah. Seven of pentacles. Maybe you're waiting for money, waiting for something, something that you planted seed in. This could even be a relationship or a marriage here where you're taking a very passive approach to this relationship where you're just kind of just waiting for things to turn, to change. You understand that this right now is a period of frustration and no activity between the two of you for whatever reason. This also could be Saturn teaching tough lesson. The word tough coming up again, tough cycle ending. You know, maybe you guys are going to come back together. That could be an energy of somebody wanting to reach out to you, wanting to spy on you, asking about you. There's somebody who's reframing from talking to you or you talking to them because it, it causes argument. Um, five of sword. There could even be heavy jealousy, backbiting, 
uh, reversal. This is why you need help in terms of a relationship or whatever you're engaging in because you need a plan of how to get out of this, how to move forward. Intuitively, you know something. Some of you want something else to develop in your life or in this relationship. Either you want to go another way. Um, you just don't see it moving forward. You see that this is just defeat or you feel defeated. You want to give up or there needs to be a giving up. Um, this is like an energy of somebody not being able. This is repression or something being repressed, not being able to um, be yourself, speak your mind, um, show, show the true and real you. Um, with the five of swords is self um, self interest and maybe even aggressive or aggression. It's a lack of communication again. So it's like lack of you communicating with somebody where the energy is all about self and they're aggressive as hell. It's just like there's no give here for whatever reason. You could be dealing with um, an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Um, somebody has their freedom and the other person doesn't. It makes someone infuriated, angry. Um, you need help or you, you want more help or you're asking for more help. Yeah. This is what I have for you, Capricorn. If it resonates for you, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Go over to the website, book your own personal reading there. Ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the Buy Ella Coffee link. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and uh, Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Thank you, guys. Many blessings to you. Take care.